Now let's place a headline. I'm going to click add new style, go to headline and click OK. I'm just going to enter a font for my headline and the style. And then I'm just going to play around a bit. Let's see. Gonna play with the size here. And I actually want it to go over on uh, multiple rows here so that I can play with my lettering and see if I can find a combination that looks good. So let's say that we're happy with this, or if we're not happy with this, you can actually go to custom letting and enter your own letting. Uh, and it could be based around 12 points. So you can enter like 12, um, let's see here what we can do. I can enter. Now we only support up to five levels in the dropdown, but if you want like uh, another uh, step here, you could go here, you can enter 12 by six, and it will still be, aligned to the grid now once again personally i think it's about making it look good and the most important thing is that the body copy follows the baseline grid because when it goes over multiple columns if it doesn't um, uh, snap or align with the with the baseline grid it's going to it's not going to align over the multiple columns Okay, now that we've done that, let's add a sub column. Once again, go to add new style, select subhead, and I'm actually gonna work with the same font here, but a different style, let's see light. I'm just going to copy some text here. And I'm going to make sure that I apply it because now the body copy is applied to it. And I'm going to play with the size here. And once I get a size that I think looks about right, I'm going to play with the letting here. So here's um, a tricky part. Sometimes it's not going to, you're not going to find a combination that works, that looks perfectly. And that's when you use the custom letting. So, uh, let's see that I would like to have like 22 and it simply feels better than run with it because, um, as I've said earlier, it's about making it look good, uh, instead of being forced and being a slave to the actual grid. So sometimes you can actually break the grid and it's actually going to be better for you.